Next, we want to make sure that we avoid any excessive side to side movement. All right, and that's really falling out of good posture. Often people are walking and they're just leaning towards their stance leg. All right, and as they lean towards the stance leg, meaning the leg they're standing on right here, all that motion is coming through the lower back and you're gradually wearing out your lower back. Furthermore, it shuts off your buttocks and I won't go into all the reasons why that's a bad thing, but it predisposes you to hip pain, knee pain, and low back pain. So not a good thing. So we wanna make sure that we keep that good posture and that spine remains vertical. So we wanna avoid any side to side movement. Just the same, we wanna avoid what I call a booty walk. All right, so a booty walk is where I would kick the hip out to the side like this. So here I'm actually getting motion through my lower back. So not a good thing, all right? And that's actually overstretching some of the hip muscles and it's a major factor in conditions like hip bursitis, not a good thing. The reason why people have this tendency to sway side to side is they're walking in a wide base of support like they just got off a horse. So if you're in a wide base of support, it's physically impossible to not sway side to side. So what do we need to do? We need to bring the feet just a little bit closer together. Not like you're walking on a tightrope, but you can see as I bring my feet close together, my spine remains vertical, like it is right now. If I simply bring my feet a little bit wider apart, I start to sway, all right? So when you walk, Keep that good posture, avoid side-to-side -side movement. By golly, that's brilliant!